Hi guys, it's Jess with Jess is Blessed and I had a request for a video about how I keep cloth diaper laundry for two babies, how I keep it when it's dirty. And it's a topic that you actually don't really see discussed very often. And so this video will be about that. I hope you enjoy this video and I hope it's helpful. So when Georgia was really little, she was in the tiny newborn diapers, and I primarily, like 95% of the time, used Grovia all-in-ones. And so they are all-in-one, one piece, and so I didn't have a bunch of pieces of her laundry. Um, they're tiny, and so what I would do is, if you look up here, I have, would hang one small wet bag for Georgia's and one wet bag for Gunner's. And Georgia's were tiny, so I could fit, you know, quite a few of them, quite a few in there before I would have to, you know, worry about it being full. Although I would always do diaper laundry at least every two days. Uh, the main reason that I kept their diapers separate is because Georgia's uh, poop was staining everything. She was jaundiced and so her poop uh, was more yellow than I than it normally is I guess and it was just staining everything and so I didn't want it to stain Gunner's diapers and although I spray out every diaper um, most people don't do that but I spray out every diaper and rinse every diaper uh, I just didn't want any residuals to stain Gunner's diapers and so what I would do is fill that one with Georgia's and then I would fill this other one with Gunner's and um, then for a while I started just putting the covers or the diaper shells, you know, the outside, the pocket of the diaper, whatever. I started um, just putting those in uh, a wet bag and then putting the inserts in another wet bag. Um, I kind of just started doing that for a while. Um, I've kind of experimented with different things and now um, although, and let me just backtrack for one second, but I have always washed the baby's laundry together. Uh, I didn't see any purpose in doing two different loads when it could all fit in one, especially with the tiny newborn diapers. They really didn't bulk up the laundry, laundry loads that much. And so uh, I, I've always done all the laundry in one load every other day or sometimes every day depending on how much laundry the babies go through um now i have gotten to this is actually it's on the floor we don't really have a better place to keep it so this is where it's at but this is our wet bag and this is actually full of diaper laundry right now and what i do is starting in the morning when the babies wake up I take off their morning diapers and I throw them in this bucket here in the bathtub. You can see it's also, it also doubles as a washing bucket. This is the plunger that's used just for washing diapers. That's why this hole's in the lid. So this is um, also for hand washing diapers. But I um, secure the lid on it. Uh, I put the dirty diapers in, fill it up with cold water, and secure the lid so that my toddler can't get to it. And close that. And then uh, my toddler can't get to the diapers, but I let them soak for a couple hours. And so essentially that's like our pre-wash that um, a lot of people do. Since we don't have our own washer and dryer, we have coin-operated laundry. I do our pre-wash this way. And so I pour that water out and let them soak again. And then, then really, really, you know, let them, let them rinse out. Cause you can see that there's two buckets in there. One has holes and the other one doesn't. And so I really let the water drain out and let them um, get more dry. And then I put, transfer them to this wet bag. And so that really works as our pre-wash. And then I do two wash cycles in the coin-operated laundry. And then I take out the diaper shells. 
um, sometimes, to be honest, if I'm in a hurry sometimes and I don't want to go hang them all up. Sometimes I do dry them, uh, but then I throw it all in the dryer and dry it. Sometimes it even takes two times in the dryer. And so at 75 cents for each load of wash laundry and 75 cents for each drying load, um, even though I'm only doing one load, one whole load of cloth diapers every two days, it sometimes costs up to $3. And so I should be better about hanging them to dry, but it's just such another pain and another step to come in, set up the, uh, the, dry, the drying rack and then hang them all up. And so I've just found it's more convenient to dry them. And then when I pull them out of the washer, um, I put them in stacks. I separate it out into Georgia's diapers, Gunner's diapers. Then I do pre-folds and microfiber inserts, um, hemp inserts, and I just kind of separate it all out. Then I put them all together and put them back on the shelf. And so that is my routine. I do wash all the laundry together. Um, somebody else, other people that have two babies in cloth might do it differently. Uh, but this works really well for me. I hope this video helps you and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up Please leave any comments if you have two babies in cloth or if you're about to have two babies in cloth Or any ideas that you have for cloth they bring videos and as always. Thank you so much for watching Thank you to my daughter for being my videographer. I love you Bye